Hello everyone! If this is the first video of mine you've ever seen, my name is Jacqueline and thank you so much for watching and coming to my channel. So I have a haul for you guys today. As I'm sure so many of you know and have already shopped for, it has been the Victoria's Secret semi-annual sale. That actually is over, and for one of the first times in the many years of my life since I started shopping at Victoria's Secret, I did not make the sale in time. But thankfully, because I am signed up um, to get the Victoria's Secret emails, I was notified that they have a giant clearance after the semi-annual sale happens. So, not only do I get the awesome sale prices, but I got an additional 40% off of that. These were dirt cheap. Oh my goodness, it was just crazy. The problem was is that it was really, really picked over. And it was a bit messy, which was kind of just discouraging. You don't like to see gorgeous Victoria's Secret lingerie just thrown on the ground. It's, it's sad, to be honest with you. Okay, so these were the first ones I got yesterday at the South Lake location. And this was my smaller bit. I didn't find a whole lot there. So the first item I got, and I just, oh, so cute, is a makeup bag, and it is one from the um, Victoria's Secret Fashion Show in London, and it's just adorable, really cute. I'm sure you've seen it. I know a lot of girls got it when it came out. It was originally $30.50, and I was like, heck no, it's... Victoria's Secret is so overpriced, that's why I always go for sales, or if I have a coupon or something, that's why I get their emails, because it's way overpriced for what it is. Um, yes, it's nice stuff. Yes, the label's nice, but the quality isn't really as expensive as they're charging for it. So I do love it. It's really cute. Nice little bag. Sequiny, totally sequiny. Has a little angel wings. Victoria's Secret. Cute little angel wing on the zipper, and it's a good size, lots of room. This is adorable, and I'm super bummed that it was the only TCU shirt I was able to get. Um, TCU obviously is um, the college here in Fort Worth, and we're all very proud to be TCU fans. Um, and Pink does make TCU clothing. Unfortunately, they had a lot of SMU stuff, which is in Dallas, but TCU is in Fort Worth, and that's what I like. Um, so it is very basic, and it's just a purple top that says Horn Frogs on it. Um, it doesn't even say pink anywhere but on the label down here, but it's going to be a good t-shirt for game day, and yeah, that's what I thought. Again, it was only $5, and it's going to be a good TCU shirt. I can't pass them up for games and events and things like that. This one is super duper cute, and it, it is a medium. It's a little bit big on me, but because it is a sleep shirt, I didn't really care, and I got this one for $7, and I don't have an original price on it because there was no tag. Um, but I don't care. It's super duper cute. Pink and hologram, light little leopard print on the sleeves, and just like a raglan to sleep in. Again, like I said, it is a little bit big. It's going to be a bit big on me, but it's a night shirt, and that's what I sleep in, and it's going to be incredibly comfortable. So I'm totally happy to have it, especially for $7. They had these kind of hidden. Um, they were with the bras, but you couldn't see them, and there was only a small and a large left. And I was like, well, that's an interesting box. I think it'll be cute on my shelf. I don't know if you've seen my shelf up there, but I love Victoria's Secret. I have a ton of their stuff up there. Um, and so I open it up, and it's the cutest little nighty. Oh, it's just silky, silky soft. I mean, it is nice, nice, nice. Incredibly flattering. They do call it a slip. Um, I don't really need a slip that I know of, at least. Um, but I will wear it as like a nighty, something like that, and I think it's going to be adorable on. So definitely a great deal. I paid $17 for it, which was a little bit steep, but it was a $70 nighty, so I think that's a good deal. Okay, next is this gorgeous little pink crop top. And I saw this at the South Lake store, but they only had an extra small. And again, I can wear their extra smalls, but I was afraid it would be too tight for the type of shirt it is because it is a crop. And because, I mean, I can wear it now, but by the time it becomes summer, when I will be able to really wear this, I'm going to be in much better shape too. And I just wanted it to fit nicely and not be too tight. Again, the crop, I don't want it digging in anywhere it shouldn't be digging. Um, what's cute about it is that the back is 
a heart cutout. I don't know if you can really tell. Obviously it's black on black, but there you can kind of see. Cute little heart cutout all across the back. So again, this is summery. This is weekend. This is going to the beach. How cute will this be over a swimsuit bottom? And this as the top, I think it will be super gorgeous. I got these two gorgeous bras. This first one is in a leopard print. I'm sure you've seen them. We all saw them come out. They are just the lace bras. There is no padding. It is just a soft cup and it is unlined. Um, but what I thought they would be great for, obviously for sleeping, I do have a couple of bralettes that I like to sleep in, um, but just kind of wearing around the house, um, maybe on the during the summer, something like that. I think they're going to be really, really cute. Um, again, yeah, and, and these were $5 a piece, $5. So I went ahead and I got the leopard and I also got the um, fuchsia pink one. Isn't that adorable? I think they're going to be really cute. Again, doesn't really give you any um, padding or anything like that, so it's not going to make you look any larger than you already are, um, but I don't really care about that. It's just going to really define and look really, really nice, especially if you're you know, under a top or something like that. I think they'll be really sexy. Okay, these next two items I got for my mother, and I, I, just, I wish she was home right now so I could give in to them. And the first one, because of her New Year's resolutions, I got her a sports bra. And I love, love, love the incredible sports bras. Victoria's Secret just knocked it out of the park when they went in with the sports bra line. And they know that. I don't have to tell them that. They know that. They've been selling like wildfire. Um, so I have one. My mother also has one. We wear them all the time. But I thought I'd get her another one. Maybe give her some motivation um, for her New Year's resolution. I am not super crazy about the print. It's not the best print ever. Um, I typically go for something girlier, pink, you know, cute prints, things like that. But it's not bad. Not bad one bit. It is pink and purple and green and the thing is I mean it's still cute and it still has a great shape and is still what she needs as far as a sports bra goes. Um, this is a 36D. She technically is a 34 double D. However, a 36D is its sister size. They are essentially the same size. Um, so she'll she'll be fine. She'll be able to get away with the it. The other thing I got for her were these gorgeous, gorgeous white lounge pants. And they're nothing special except down the side, they have cute little pink sequins with a heart and VS. And I think they're super duper cute. And I am concerned they are large, so I'm concerned they might be a little bit too big for her. Um, but again, they're just lounge pants. They do have a drawstring and they're made for you know hanging around the house or just going to pick up the kids or something like that so I think she will adore them. So this is the last item and again it's nothing incredibly special but it is a wonderful black tank and if you've seen one black tank you've seen them all except I really do care for Victoria's Secrets. Um, something about theirs just tend to last longer than the ones you say you just pick up at Target. Um, the ones at Target tend to lose their shape, they stretch out, they break apart, get holes. They tend to do that much faster than a higher quality one. So that was my big Victoria's Secret haul. I got some really, really great deals. So if you're interested, if you want to get out there, get out there now. I'm telling you, things are already picked over, um, but you may find something that you really, really like for a really good price and you're not going to regret at least going to look. So let me know if you like this haul. Give it a thumbs up if you love Victoria's Secret, you love their semi-annual sale, and you love getting great deals on some great stuff. If you haven't already, then hit subscribe. Stick around for more fun we have here on my channel. I really hope you stay. I would love to have you as a friend. And if you'd like to follow me elsewhere, I am at Fort Worth Famous on Twitter, Tumblr, and Instagram. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch. I really hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next one. Remember that you are already famous in your hometown. Okay, girls. Love you guys. Bye, y'all.